tonight. It's all about the bold and the beautiful. We're here at Hello Canada's celebration of the 50 most beautiful Canadians. We're going to catch up with celebrities, athletes and other stars and find out how they define beauty. So we're here to celebrate the 50 most beautiful people. How do you guys define beauty? Actually, uh, I think they made a typo. It was the 51 most beautiful people. We were thrown in together. Yeah. <laughs> there are other twins on, the, on We this make list? it half each. Yeah. So it's 50 because we're half each. I, I think uh, for me, it's, it's a whole package thing. I think it really, like, I, I go out of my way. I try to be a good person. I try to help everybody around me and set a good example. And so I think seeing that in other people too, that's beautiful. It's very cheesy and cliche, but it has to be from the inside. I think somebody that can laugh a lot and um, reserves judgment and you know, I think accepts all human beings, whichever way they want to be. I think that's beautiful. And then it can also be um, discomfort as well. For instance, I just put on these shoes, and there's some discomfort there, but I, I, I'm fine. I'm liking it. There's a tension between the comfort and the discomfort. Scott, how are you? Good. Yeah, I'm good, man. Good to see you. Good to see you. How's life treating you? Life's pretty good. I made the list. You're one of the 50 most beautiful. How do you feel? Uh, I feel like I must have bribed the right person. I think that's what I must have done here. No, it's very flattering. Uh, it's an honor to be on the list and uh, I'm in good company for sure. Figure, you know, they must be looking for inner beauty this year though, obviously. <laughs> Speaking of inner beauty, would you compare interior design to the beauty of a person? It's the inside that counts. You know what, that is a very good point. I say it's important what's on the surface, you gotta maintain it, but what's more important is what's behind those walls, right? Because that design isn't gonna last very long if you've got no insulation or if there's an electrical problem. And I think humans, we're wired the same way. Things can look good on the surface, but that isn't gonna last very long if what's inside isn't just as good, if not better. Hello's motto, actually, is life is beautiful. So really all year round we're celebrating not just physical beauty but inner beauty, personality, talent, generosity, a generosity of spirit and, um, and everybody on our list really embodies that. For women, I think a beautiful woman is uh, someone who doesn't take herself too seriously and is funny. I love funny women, I think they're extraordinarily beautiful. And I love that nowadays we can have women that are both funny and attractive, it's not just one or the other. And so uh, uh, for, for men as well, a sense of humor, a good sense of self, it's not really about the aesthetic. A sense of knowing who you are, Yes. Yeah. Unapolog unapologetic of the person you are inside. Yes. Being fun with fashion um, and not taking yourself too seriously uh, and living life to the fullest and not worrying about what other people say. You know, doing yourself, doing you, being true to yourself. Uh, you know what? You're born an original. Don't die a copy. That's what I say. <laughs> so well said. Thanks, Veronica, and have fun tonight. Thank you, Justin. It's all about what's on the inside. I'm sure everybody says that, but it's truly, truly the honest truth. Uh, some of the most incredible people I know are certainly not walking the red carpet tonight. A personality and the person's inner world I think is the most beautiful. You can have someone who is traditionally perhaps not the best looking, but then they have such an interesting inner world that they're just like captivating, you know? Lipstick and hair, high heels. Um, I think that the beauty is definitely within. You know, you can yeah. see a really gorgeous person, but if they've got an ugly soul, I'm sorry. Yeah. It doesn't make them not... I couldn't have said it better myself. Attractive um, anymore, yeah. truthfully. My mom always said that when you're happy, you look pretty, and I think it's absolutely true. I mean, a cliche as it is, beauty comes from within, and, and that really shines through. So I think, um, you know, a genuine smile goes a long way. How do you define beauty? Honestly, and I, I say this all the time, but with honesty, like whether you... Oh my God. <laughs> You go and get a drink and then we're gonna talk. Okay. <laughs> I'm excited. <laughs> I'm that was that like a star moment for me. Yes. Yeah, I just met Jillian Harris.